Shall I brew more? It's still warm and it's been a while. Well, the law of cooling is a decaying exponential, but you need a measurement on the liquid to get the heat transfer coefficient. Don't worry about the measurement for now. We'll find a new way to think about it. All right, so forget the tea entirely. What if we thought of molecules like people? Yes, moving at impossible speeds, bumping into one another. And the amount of pressure people feel can be understood by how frequently these bumps happen. More people, more pressure. <laughs> no, not necessarily. How big is the room? Say they're crammed into a crowded hallway, jostling and bumping, late for class. High pressure, yes? Leva, are you all right? I am. Now let's place them in a grand ballroom. The same people. No more, no less. Only now, ten times the size. Enough to dance freely around the room. More volume. Fewer collisions. Lower no pressure. pressure. Let's write a paper together. On what? This isn't a new thought, just a new way of seeing it. What if this is the way to prove the existence of molecules? <laughs> Does this sound like fun, Dolly? You and me writing a paper that could change the world. The probability of chaos. <laughs> Not the title <laughs> I would choose, but we can discuss it.